In previous lecture, we learned how to create a component in CLI project. Now in this one, we'll be taking it further. Let's say the content that we have over here is not a simple text, but HTML. In that case, how we can render it over here in our div. For instance, if I just go ahead and say that this components should be strong. Now if I do this, save it, and here you can see the result coming out as strong components. Now that's not what we want. So in order to have this rendered as HTML, we provide this vHTML attribute and the content becomes its value. So this content that we have over here is what we have enclosed within single quotes. And now when we run this one, here you can see that the components is actually being rendered as HTML rather than a simple text. So that's how we can include HTML content in our component.